Hello everybody and welcome to Uligan's Christmas is Coming. This is a fun little Christmas game that Graham from Two Left Thumbs invited me to play, along with Nezaru and Super Positive. The game plays a lot like Monster Prom but without the dating aspect and an obvious Christmas theme. We played the game in one sitting and I'll probably break this up into four videos for you guys. And one thing to note is that the video is from Super Positive's perspective because my video unfortunately was corrupt, but due to the nature of the gameplay it shouldn't matter too much because you can still see everything that I'm doing. You can find everyone's channels in the description and a Merry Christmas to you all. I do hope Hope you enjoy. Also, make sure to wait until the end of this first episode, as there's going to be a surprise that was gifted to me by a subscriber and Twitch viewer named Voss, which is absolutely amazing and possibly one of the coolest gifts I've ever been given. So that'll be at the end of the video. Make sure to watch out for that. Who's player one? Okay, whoever it's player one, can you please leave me the second one? I really oh, want I want it to be the second one. No, leave the me second the second one's clearly the most fun looking one. <laughs> I love the second one. He, he Whoa, wait, wait, who's player me. one? So we could Me. I'm player keep one. Track. Turtles player one. I really did want to take the second one, but I guess Paul technically <laughs> dibs it, even though the game gave me the opportunity. I'm gonna be real cool here, Paul. I hope you remember that later. <laughs> So I'm I'm selecting the third one in. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Better before I get the last choice. <laughs> that guy looks cool too. Before you would steal it away, anyways. <laughs> it's the beginning of November. Christmas is practically here. Uh, Why is the first option soda jack? Is there anything that we do here? Is the text gonna progress? Oh, there you go. It's me. I think I have to progress it. Ah. Do you want to narrate for yeah, us? Yeah, do, do the narration <laughs> since you have to progress I, it. I can hardly read, so... <laughs> well, we should all take turns, like we should popcorn read, so I can be like, up at the... Yeah, uh, <laughs> <laughs> up at the North Pole, winter comes early and we're all just waking up from one, one year long nap. It's our year long last nap. <laughs> Damn, I already, I best. told you. <laughs> I told you. Okay, with only eight weeks until the big night, we'll be ready. Or will there be another year without Santa Claus? Wait, what? He's gone. Another year with Santa Okay, you need to explain <laughs> this to me, game. Another Wait, year without yeah. Santa Claus? We've already <laughs> missed Santa once? That's really sad. That bums me out. <laughs> that immediately, starting off with the big questions, what happened last year? No, yeah, no, 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 that year is this year. It's 2020. All the bad things happened this year. <laughs> so, guys, I, I have the option to go to the elf gym. If you no. Can no. <laughs> we get charm there? Soda jerk. Yeah, go we pump iron. Let's go pump iron at the elf gym. Train strength. Train strength. You get to work out at the North Pole. Pump and iron. Let's do it. <laughs> Christmas isn't Christmas without some heavy lifting. Tell Lou Ferrigno what's up. Oh my god. <laughs> Spend the week picking up heavy presents and putting them down. You gain three strong. <laughs> You're, you are three strong. Oh my god. It's together strong. <laughs> <laughs> Next to a marshmallow climbing wall, someone has stacked a Christmas tree sized mountain of boxes. With a shout, Krampus runs past you, launches off a, sli a side wall, and lands halfway up the marshmallows. The hell he's <laughs> just his arms he grapples himself to the other side of the climbing wall and throws himself onto the box structure this is an elaborate attack <laughs> is, is just parkour <laughs> runs perfectly on his hooves and turns to you and hand <laughs> hand stretches up. there you go <laughs> dude this is a romance story if i've ever heard it ah. <laughs> oh my god this is great with all he's the... just trying to spoon you impress <laughs> you or, or narcor <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what do we pick? Nag <laughs> Narco. <laughs> you go to I'm sorry, Krampus, I don't want to date you. <laughs> you go back to your routine nearby, but continue watching as Krampus builds uh, a little course for himself. You may not want to do it yourself, but it gives you some idea on how to work out at home when the gym shuts down in December, or all year. Uh, right. You gain, you gain one creative. creative. Okay. Usually, uh, usually you're not having, like, big ideas at the gym. That's You're getting strength <laughs> and creativity? That's... Oh. You, you go to the gym and basically, like, I could make this at home. Why am I coming here to build a gym at home? I was fully prepared to go to Soda Jerk. 
but now the abominable wood sounds really thrilling. I don't know. That doesn't sound like a good place to start. I feel <laughs> Wouldn't like the I'd abominable be woods be like? I don't know. I feel like that'd be dangerous. I, really? If, if the woods can melt. <laughs> but Krampus's shack seems very kinky. Well, yeah, he's, he's, he's. I mean, Krampus seems cool. like yeah. Then he's Krampus jacked. just tries seducting you into like jumping into boxes uh, <laughs> i don't want to be his what's... second choice that's a good that's a good point i'm gonna go oh. to the workshop i can't tell if he was sedu seducing me or just being sort of a chad <laughs> <laughs> it does seem like that yeah he was just trying to impress literally anyone yeah. whether it's sexual or not i'm gonna actually help santa which i'm pretty sure is a <laughs> goal and go and make presents you spend the entire week inside the workshop, hammering away at toys with your fellow elves on the assembly line. Don't forget to whistle while you work. I can't whistle. <laughs> Can you sad. whistle? It makes it makes no, the unpaid labor go faster. Only kids that can whistle get presents for Christmas. I'm but screwed. Sin that was no. That was the best whistling I had to offer. You <laughs> gained one jolly, one speedy, and are paid one gumdrop. You I got paid? You got so paid? I appreciate that gumdrop gum was Gumdrops are the currency? Yeah, yeah oh, that's jolly. the follow-up question. <laughs> jolly makes so much more sense than jelly. <laughs> <laughs> Not that jolly makes a ton of sense. Uh, I, I have a few questions. Like, what is the G what's the GDP of the North Pole? <laughs> right. Yeah, with how, the conversion rate. <laughs> how many gumdrops converts to one US dollar? Please, I need to know. <laughs> I hope one gumdrop is at least minimum wage. I <laughs> Wait, I, oh, that's right. You worked an entire week. You got paid oh God. one gumdrop for an entire week. That's really abysmal, then, I think. I think we're being taken <laughs> advantage of. Wage slave. I think we should unionize. Yeah, I think we'll loop here. I'm down. It's, I'm, we, it's, it's, begin, it's begun. Just another day in the workshop when a commotion breaks out in the quality assurance office. A stuffed duck flies past your head as you go to investigate, growling as it lands on the floor <laughs> behind you. As you round the corner, it becomes clear. Someone mixed up all the squeakers in the toys. Oh, so he's growly instead of squeaky. I don't... Ha like I have to work a month to bribe this duck? <laughs> no. <laughs> you may not be able to fix the issue, but you can help find who done it. You backtrack your way to the closest squeaker stuffing line and begin demanding answers from the forewoman. She's equally as confused as you, and your yelling only worsens the chaos. I'm oh, picturing God. like an L.A. Noir like doubt uh. sequence. <laughs> It's, uh, I like the way as well. It's not an option. Do you go in shouting? No, you go in shouting. You have to. <laughs> yeah, well, always. At the end of the day, no one knows who to blame. Well, that was useless. And the toys are taken <laughs> to the misfit pile underneath Santa's workshop. Oh, the well, misfit pile is where the great. children are burned. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, like, and then the lost souls of the burnt children are going to infuse with the misfit pile. Of, this is we're starting a disaster here like inevitably you lose one creative i was already at wait was i at zero i think i, think I was already were, at zero yeah, i think you were yeah oh it's good to know that it doesn't like give you negative points. oh my yeah. god look at look at the next to the eight weeks till christmas look at the cute little icon oh His my character. god look at me i'm so cute <laughs> actually i i really do enjoy all the character designs i think they're all really nice. cute yeah but the, I the, am the, the cutest. The fourth character just reminds me of uh, Gibraltar from Apex Legends. <laughs> let me see. I want. I want to go to the kitchen. I want, let Let's see. I can bake. I can taste test, or I can go back. I'm gonna bake. <laughs> oh my god! He looks a lot eviler there. You spend. <laughs> Is that week... how you looked when you were making your cookies? <laughs> yeah. Yes. Oh god, that's right. Cook you were babies. just making cookies. <laughs> You spend the Do you week... know the meme of the bread being microwaved, the POV of the bread? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is the exact... The, oh, God. It must be a nightmare. <laughs> you spend the week baking goodies. Some will go to the elves as they get back into the swing of things. Some will be saved for the midwinter feast. And some you'll keep for yourself. Oh, God, that's why I'm looking so angry and greedy. <laughs> 
After a week's worth of work, I think maybe you earned a couple cookies. I earned most of them. <laughs> <laughs> Better cookies and gumdrops. Gumdrops have low value here. You gain one speedy, one creative, and are paid one gun drop. One of the side rooms is a small walk-in library filled with cookbooks. Rummaging through this library is Mal. Before Ooh. you can ask what's going on, he puts a finger to your lips. To oh. your lips? Oh, oh my. my. I am oh fucking feeling seduced. <laughs> if you agree to tell no one, I'll let you in on what I find. No oh, problem. shit. Let me see. Slip him a cookie. You know what? No, I'm fucking <laughs> dedicated to this. I want to know what he's looking for. Help Mal. I wish you could bribe him. <laughs> oh, he looks you up and down. Oh my god, this is <laughs> exactly wrong how game, he wanted like this to turn out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't trust you not to tell. What? Fuck you! You just You're gonna asked get off me. in the first week here. You just got. I think joined. you failed the skill check. Right. He said shutting the door on you. Well, that's not nice. You lose one. Oh. No, my job. Wait, did I have any to begin with? You I did. Don't think you I did. did have. Oh no, no, you didn't. No, no, I didn't have any jolly. It's you fine. Weren't, you weren't even slightly jolly to start with, so that's fine. Yeah, yeah no, it's fine. Sour pills. <laughs> yeah. I'm a real grin. You just, you're just watching your cookies bake, and you're just mad. The guy not said, jolly, like, I'll slightest. promise to like give you some of what I find if you promise not to tell, and I agree. And he's like, I don't trust you. Then why would you tell me? <laughs> 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 it was a word. test. Now he's going to rat you out. <laughs> <laughs> now Santa Claus is going to throw me out of the North Pole. <laughs> okay, let's see. Where do I go? I'll go to the soda jerk because it's a funny word. It's true. It's a good reason. <laughs> <laughs> drink or clean? I would rather drink from the soda jerk. Oh, we think and so you reason? spend the week warming your signature stool at the end of the counter of the soda jerk. Signature stool. Downing one sugary <laughs> beverage after another. I'm really glad that you looked at signature stool and thought the same thing I did. <laughs> I, yeah, my brain really skipped the beat on that one. Like, <laughs> I, I, I heard that and was like, oh, they're probably talking about the seats. But in my mind, I'm like, poo? <laughs> I, I'm laying down my best work in here. <laughs> they're warming it. They're warming it. <laughs> I gained two speedy and one jolly. Ugh. And so a group of youthful elves stride into the soda jerk looking for trouble. They mock several older patrons before Mal takes note. Who is this Mal that we keep hearing of? Uh, yeah, yeah Mal's a dick. Mal. <laughs> Usually a prankster himself, Mal appears to take a specific dislike to these youths. Oh. These darn kids! Oh, okay, so Mal's kind of <laughs> an just asshole. A <laughs> I wish I had gotten that context when I met him. <laughs> <laughs> and as he goes for a classic something on your shirt bit, the group turns its back on him by slapping a kick me sign on his back. Mal walks away dejected. They made fun of the old man. He just doesn't like kids. What's not to like about that? that he he we brought like uh, the prank the youths. <laughs> pep talk Mal or do we prank the youths? I say I prank the youths. You march up to the youths with an excuse me. You then attempt the same something on your shirt bit just Mal uh, that he led with to the same result. <laughs> Mal shares a Sunday with you as several kids kick both of you as they walk past. Wait, what? Kick? <laughs> you lose one strong. You guys, you guys both got kick me. They just booted your muscles off. <laughs> <laughs> Let's, Let's not, not forget, forget the midwinter feast. Oh my. I guess we can take turns on these in between yeah. bits. <laughs> Once Santa is awake, he's going to be terribly hungry. He's just. Wait, is he gone or just asleep? Uh, yes. <laughs> out, yeah. He's yeah. just milk been and asleep cookies. all year. <laughs> milk, and <laughs> milk and cookies alone will not do. Santa's very demanding this year. <laughs> he desires come. <laughs> oh, oh god, I was gonna say combat? I thought that's where you were going? He desires blood, but there's a... Yeah, oh, both no. are equally shocking, I would say. <laughs> oh my god, I was but... not expecting that. 
was there was there anything to determine a new order or was it just a random shuffle? I, I think, think it's it was just an... random because it, I'm it, going it, first now. Yeah, yeah, I think it's just random. Oh wait, no, is it reverse order? I think it's reverse order. It's reverse, maybe. Oh, okay. so the person who goes last goes again. Okay. I'll go to Krampus's shack. Encourage Krampus, dissuade him. Encourage him. Deep <laughs> down, you know Krampus is only trying to make the world a nicer place by destroying all the evil children. You spend a week trying to help him find the naughty and nice list. All over camp. I mean, wow, I've been playing like... so much Monster Camp that <laughs> these two just <laughs> blended together. You guys can help Krampus, but I, I, he seems like he wants to fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> and you're not into it, is what I'm gathering? <laughs> okay, okay, well, okay. Uh, I, I'm reser I, I've reserved my judgment so far, because first thing he did is just flip off a roof and climb over some boxes. Before you close out of this menu, can we just take a moment to realize that Krampus is a furry? Like, <laughs> like if you he's look a demon. This, he's like a demon furry hybrid. <laughs> Furries are confirmed evil. Got it. I, oh no, that's not what I meant. <laughs> I think we just established. Uh, yes, like, yes, that, that is of course what you meant. Yes, you gain one nice, one strong, and one creative. I, Krampus I think we goes. Team up with Krampus and help him overthrow Santa, like you were saying. Kill the kids. This is the new way. And yes, he does go sprinting out of his shack as you walk by. Out of curiosity, you follow him into the abominable woods. <gasps> As you finally lose sight of him, a ps comes from a nearby bush. It's Jack Frost! Wait, he's in this game? Why is he living in the bush? I know who that is. I don't know who Mal is. <laughs> you just helped Mal, Krampus Jack and Jack Frost? At least we recognize Jack Frost. Yeah. Krampus is getting close to the naughty and nice list. I need your help by throwing him off. Why'd I give him a surfer dude voice? <laughs> he has <laughs> you a fake version of the list. <laughs> And then he asks you to run as fast as you can to get ahead of Krampus and leave it somewhere for him to find. Like a treasure map. Help hey, Jack hey. tell Krampus. Giving him a fun scavenger hunt. <laughs> yeah, we help Jack, sure. So, what reason do we have to help Krampus at the moment? Or to help either of these, really? <laughs> Instinct. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Your Christmas spirit, obviously. <laughs> also, why is Jack Frost just in a bush? Like, oh, yes. You know, that's... <laughs> <laughs> don't like, call him Jack for nothing. He, he's falling on hard <laughs> times, okay? Like, l let him be. <laughs> Gumdrops don't pay a lot here. Yeah. <laughs> right. Oh, God, yeah, you're right. <laughs> they don't And pay. with a reason to catch up, you're able to get around Krampus. You give yourself a solid lead... Climb into one of the trees and lodge the fake list into the branches so that Krampus will see it when running by. Okay, now I'm just confused by your choices. You went to his house initially because <laughs> you wanted to help him. And then all it takes is Jack Frost being like, yo, I got a fake list. And you went to try and throw him off of the goal you tried to persuade him to do. <laughs> I mean, look, you did go to try to help Krampus and the first thing he did was run into the woods. So <laughs> I, don't I know like the magic guy. man's funny words. What can I say? I gotta say, you were like, hey, hey, Krampus, I have this cool plan for you. And he's like, see ya, boy. <laughs> just runs out the house. There's very strange motivations on both sides here. I, I yeah. get it. <laughs> and so we get some distance and watch as Krampus falls for the trick. You gain one creativity. Hey, and that's nice. it. Well, we got him in I wish there were like ne uh, I wish there were negative ailments to this as well. You gain one bitch energy. <laughs> like, you gain one naughty, like things like that, just so that like as you're a dick to other people. <laughs> Ooh, I want one naughty too. I think I want to go. Sabotage. I don't want to sabotage. <laughs> what is this option? Chaotic evil going on here. <laughs> Play test the toys. I'm trying to help. I'm trying to be a good elf. You spend the week testing out the toys Santa invented last year. Do your best to make sure nothing is wrong with them. You gain two jolly and are paid one gumdrop. I'm rich. I'm mm. controlling this economy. I know you are. It was supposed to be a never-ending record player, a callback to getting your favorite song stuck in your head. Well, someone got the never-ending part right. The inventor only learned that it mangled the track placed in it when the first test got a Kitty Christmas album stuck in there. 
Everyone pretended it was fine and dandy for the first week, but some of the elves look like they're ready to melt. Someone has to do something. <laughs> Just <laughs> get out? What does push into it mean? <laughs> like, try to convince everyone it's a good song? <laughs> I'm so confu confused by no, that. No, you statement. guys are missing the, the nuanced metaphors of Kitty Christmas. It's <laughs> it's great. I Just think of this place for the rest of your life, you'll eventually start to like it. There's no way, like, the two things I think that it would skill check me on are strength and, like, I don't know, creativity, and I have zero of both. <laughs> but I definitely don't have strength, so maybe push into it is something else. You begin to hum along and do Christmas jigs. Oh, so maybe it's jolly. Uh, the cats are car caroling. Your spirit is infectious, and by the end of the week, others visibly like the incorrectly pitched, always skipping cat sounds. <laughs> the inventor even seems pleased with what they've... Santa? Santa seems pleased? <laughs> I oh, see no, this beer as known as the inventor. <clears throat> you gain one creative and one nice. Oh! Wait, wait nice. Nice. It's, it's the Christmas nice. present. To oh. the left of the stats. Oh. So you can, I, I did notice that Nez was also plus one, but I didn't know what it meant. So I guess if you go like sabotage and things, you, you slightly become naughty. Oh, yeah. I, but yeah, I, some, but I trip someone Krampus. Has, someone has to be naughty. At least one person, hopefully. Oh, wait. Out of curiosity, who has the highest speed at the moment? Speed? Um... I already forget. Wait, is there is there any way to like check all stats? Uh, Probably not. <laughs> Doesn't seem like it. New. Not as far as like. Oh, I can check mine by like pressing right bumper. Uh, but oh, then oh no, I I can only check yours as well. <laughs> okay, yeah. No, I was mostly asking because I am. Uh, I'm interested if the speed stat determines how quickly you move, or like who the or turn order is what I mean. Yeah, oh, yeah. oh, oh, oh. Maybe. maybe. Yeah, maybe. Okay, so we got Soda Jerk Museum of Christmas Elves Workshop. Uh, I might go to the Museum of Christmas. I don't think anybody's been there yet. No. Uh, yeah, let's go Museum of Christmas. Let's do it. Brush up a little. Ooh, I could either visit the weekly exhibit or do some research. Um, that sounds like work. I'll go to the exhibit. <laughs> <laughs> you spend the week following the ghosts of Christmas past tour around the halls of the museum. Fascinated by this week's special exhibits. You gain two creative and one yeah. jolly. You pass the curtains and red rope of this weekend special exhibit still under construction. The ghosts of Christmas presents, wispy hands, fall onto your shoulder as you walk by. They're putting the finishing touches on the Christmas of Today exhibit and would like some advice. You're brought behind the curtain and treated to a scene of a family around a Christmas tree. The parents sit excitedly on a couch watching their three children. One sitting alone and opening a gift while the other two push each other around in a toy car. Is this family? <laughs> what? <laughs> I wasn't prepared for that. I wasn't for it prepared for that. I, uh, I, I read it out loud, and then the like the 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 reality of that question <laughs> hit me. I was like, "What?" Yeah, that's baffling. Present asks, revel in the feeling, <laughs> show family quarrels. <laughs> yes, fight I said show family quarrels. I thought it was what, say, what reveal, is, what like, is reveal Chris, something terrible. <laughs> what is Christmas oh, no. if you're not going to like fight with your family <laughs> during the moment? No, I think I, here's a critical point for you to decide if you're going nice or naughty. <laughs> oh my goodness. In the chaos. Well, I don't <laughs> yeah. think going naughty actually gives me any, any benefit, does it? Besides like... <laughs> Who knows? Maybe well, you can presumably bang it Santa. Means you can yeah, I'm or, worried that if I, I mean, do show family quarrels, my my one jolly will go away. <laughs> I know this is a bit off topic, but can we talk about what's going on with his trousers in that picture? When, like, that he, looks a bit sus. He has a little bit of a bulge. <laughs> <laughs> There's a, a lot of lines dedicated to the creases in his yeah. pants. That is <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to revel in the feeling. Yeah, you are. Blush. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm dying. Why did you do that to me? <laughs> you say nothing. Uh, let the warmth take hold. You can't help but smile as the family comes to life in your mind. Turning, you nod. The ghost of Christmas present thanks you and takes you back to out of the exhibit. Your feet barely seem to touch the ground as you head home for the day. You gain two jolly. Oh, ah, damn. see? Bam. That was worth entirely showing yeah, them. That, that worked out. Hmm. Jim. Again. <laughs> <laughs> Kaya. <laughs> Never stop hitting the gym. Christmas Eve will need you in peak condition. What are these physical demands of the Christmas <laughs> occasion? <laughs> like, what is it? Oh, okay. The reindeer have died and you're pulling the sleigh. <laughs> <laughs> or did you form some the... sort of rivalry with Krampus now where you're just trying to one-up them and you don't really know why? The... But... <laughs> you spend the week making your hands and feet go fast. <laughs> <laughs> oh my okay, god. Okay then. Yeah, three speedy. Oh, wow. Damn. You, now I'm the best. Jesus, working out gives benefits. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for the dance to the gym for your daily routine, when confetti begins to fall from the ceiling, a banner drops down reading 100 walking. It's explained that you can choose a voucher to one of the gym's secret services. Oh. Se wait, okay. No, I need to know what the secret services are. <laughs> oh, no. This, you're getting an idea right here. Little known to the general population, there's a high class spa in the back rooms. Oh, that Soap sounds Man. fucking sus. <laughs> it was created for Santa to help keep him jolly. Oh, my oh, God. God. Oh, no. <laughs> but a few Jinkos were allowed in there from time to time. The offer oh. a scalp is so intense, it's said to ring out any backed up humbugs you may have. Is that what they're think calling of, it? Uh, super bad when Jonah Hill's like, ah, oh. you know, I scratch your back, you scratch yeah. mine. You know, <laughs> the funny thing about the back, my back is yeah. on my dick. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of my favorite films of all time. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> After all, the gym isn't just about the body, it's about the mind and spirit too. Sparta, gotta be. It's I gotta think be. either one of those has the, the opportunity for a very yeah. jolly time. <laughs> you feel like a s'more in the mud bath. <laughs> <laughs> the deep cold of North Pole seeps out, in, out, out of your paws in the sauna. Ooh. And the massage leaves visions of sugar plums in your head. The atmosphere is just right throughout, giving you everything you need to truly relax. The a word no massage and sugar plum both individually <laughs> brought out my favorite yeah. parts of your accent. <laughs> it was wonderful. <laughs> I love that sentence so much. Uh, I get that a lot. <laughs> <laughs> A tray of milk and cookies awaits you at the end, making you feel like the big guy himself. Too jolly. Oh my god, I mean stats on stats on stats. Yeah, that was huge. Okay, the speed definitely determines when we go in turns, because I've got okay. three speed and I'm going first. Ah, see, that's what I was looking at. <laughs> Hello, the turtle melon. How you doing, man? Uh, this is a message from myself and Anthony Voss. Um, Anthony told me about uh, your YouTube channel, uh, Rogue Like Roulette. Uh, checked it out. Um, I watched, uh, what is it? It's the Enter the Gungeon, and I enjoyed it. Um, those solo RPGs, man, I'm a real, I'm a real sucker for them. Uh, my, my all time favorite is Morrowind and I, um, I spent many, many years of my life just, uh, playing the hell out of that. So those long solo, uh, adventures are just the best. And I think it's awesome that you have a channel and that you're doing it. I think you're very talented. Your accent is delightful, always helpful when, uh, when doing a YouTube channel. And yeah, I just wish you the greatest of luck with it. Um, I think uh, I think you're gonna have a lot of success and do great things. Um, Anthony also thought um, you might enjoy uh, a little bit of uh, Starlight Brigade if I sang it for you. So here you go, man, this is for you. Lift off the fire storm ignites last thoughts of a life by candlelight. Inside the speeding satellite Halfway between the black and gray Is no place for a life to waste away I'll take the road with all the stakes 
man, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, and yeah, I just hope you have a, a great Christmas and um, uh, an awesome new year. It's It's been a freaking weird year for sure, but uh, it's very cool to see that you've kept on going with your channel and uh, you're, you're, you're bringing a lot of happiness to a lot of people. So uh, way to go, man. I'm wishing you the best. Uh, I know Anthony is too. And uh, I just hope you have a great holiday and great 2021. Thanks, man. Take care.